what is this and please tell me if you tried it it tastes amazing because as just looking at it it does I'm in stop and shop by the way guys Cape Cod Cafe look at this that shit does not look good and it's 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 on sale for $7.99 but hello like it's flatter than flat it's like flatter than a freaking pancake what is this that don't even look good I don't know. Comment below. You like that, Joe? Do you buy it all the time or not? Nah? All right. So I'm home. We went to shop and shop. Just came back. Kila wanted to get some ham and cheese. I'm cleaning the house and. Oh, I eat lunch. So this is part two. Welcome to the vlog, by the way, guys. This is part two. And if you missed part one, part one was an extremely nerve-wracking morning. And if you missed it, you should probably go and watch that before you watch this. But anyway, I'm going to show you a mini haul and what I did mm -hmm. for the rest of the day. If you have never, if you don't have a stop and shop, if you have never tried this bread, oh my god, you gotta get it in the morning time because it's so soft. And not that I really wanted to, but I haven't had a good avocado in a long time. I really do hate stop and shop. Like, Stop and Shop is so pricey to me. I don't even like to buy stuff from Stop and Shop. But they had these avocados. Green-skinned avocados. I don't really know what kind they are, but... Um, Dominican. Oh, so they're Dominican avocados. Anyway, I don't think I ever tried them. I don't know if I'm allergic. But they were nice and ripe, and they were two for five. I know I could get them from Walmart for, like, I don't know, a lot cheaper. But So I got some avocado, guys. Hopefully, it's good. I also needed to get some milk, so I got some milk, and I have no idea what I'm cooking for dinner, but I don't know. There we go, and then there was light. So I'm basically just cleaning my kitchen. Probably do some clothes, just the regular schmegular, you know? So I'm gonna put this in the microwave. Oh, and I got Angie two TV dinners. Because she likes to eat, like, the TV dinners when she comes home. And they're all processed, but she eats it. Let me just rephrase that. She asks for TV dinner. I don't know why. I'm thinking one of her friends gets it, and that's what she eats after school. So, anyway, I bought her two for $1.89, so it wasn't too bad. I normally, I still need to make a Walmart order. I, I refuse. There was some stuff that I saw, and I was like, nope. Walmart's cheaper. So anyway, I got the banquet. These were a dollar eighty nine. Remember when these used to be a dollar? <sighs> Whatever. And chicken pot pie used to be like eighty nine cents. Anyway, I got her these to try the chicken nuggets, um, and the sweet and sour. And then she got this last time and she liked it. So just something for when she comes home from school. And they did actually have chicken thigh for like, you got like 12 chicken thighs for like four bucks. But let me show you my, let me show you my freezer. My freezer is filled, okay? Just a, a whole bunch of chicken. So I do have some ground beef right there. But I did, it was tempting to buy it just because like, if all else fails, you got chicken. But... I was not about to buy more chicken, not today, but some shop has, I don't know if you're around my area, but they had a really good um, deal on chicken. Tell them what you're making, babe. About what is your, make, but why, why are you making? About to make the good old ham and cheese sandwich. And the reason why is because this stop and shop. I, I'm sure what I'm makes you what what makes you so excited about eating this ham and cheese? Because it's not on just regular bread. That's right. It's not on sliced bread. It's on Italian bread. <laughs> stop and shop has the best. Mm -hmm. Tell them, babe. I did. I was talking about it, but tell them. 
Why do you love it? Because it's so it's soft and tasty. Soft. Like there's nothing better Did for Kilo. Some? Yeah. There's nothing better for Kilo than a freaking ham and cheese sandwich. And I told him that we had American cheese and we do, but it's a it's the block. And I told him, don't buy no cheese. I said it nice and loud. What he do? I don't know why she thinks she could just tell me what to do in my life. I'm a grown man. Because we have who cheese. Can make its own decisions. It's it's American and cheese. I thought, you know, it would be a nice treat to have some deli cheese. He likes deli cheese. See, deli cheese is different. Cheese is cheese is cheese, cheese to me. But the love that I have for this family and this woman made me sacrifice the deli cheese for the block cheese. You played But for finally this one time in my life. Okay. I thought to myself, you know, it'd be really nice to buy cheese when we don't need cheese. Deli cheese, just enough. Just enough for this one sandwich. Can you imagine me for buying a four slices? Hallelujah, ma'am. Four slices. You said four. Give me. That's what you said. I try to say it on the low one. <laughs> she was like, "What?" <laughs> I'm not allowed. Because you didn't want me to hear I you ordering this freaking cheese. I need some deli cheese. So shut up. Anyway, I guess it's the little thing. So whatever. He got the freaking cheese. But. I boy got some deli cheese. Actually, I was going to do clothes. But I'm seeing that I don't need to. Because I did them already. So if you're telling me that we actually did need any. How you know there's not some up there? My brain is kind of telling me. Cause I'm looking through that right now with my Superman powers, and I don't see no mayonnaise in there, babe. I feel like there might be. And if not, I'm making an order, so... Okay, but well then we're good. Yeah. So anyway, I did the clothes, so I don't have to do them. There's like two things in there. Remember the jacket? The jacket that I said I need to wear it? I, I wore it today, though, so that was a good thing. How would you like your eggs scrambled, omelet, ovulating? <sighs> Guys, we're going to cut this avocado. Let's see how good it is. It better be good. We're going to put it on the sandwich. First, let's see if we have any mayonnaise. I use my x-ray vision. Man. You might be see. right. All right, so I got to put it on the thing. All right. Okay. This is a big avocado, though. That's the only thing. It goes bad fast. You try to eat it faster. No, no. Like, if you keep it out, it's going to get brown. Don't, don't keep it out. We got... Look. Look how big this nut is. That's ridiculous. It's all nut. Yeah, it is. I'm gonna say that that's Look a it. that's a male avocado. <laughs> uh, that's, that's Mr. Avocado to you. I don't like that. I don't like it. See, this is why I I, I don't even trust no avocados. It felt like it was nice and hard. There's a lot of jokes that can be made right now. Oh, well. Look, that's not too bad, but that 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 part is bad. That's disgusting. Well, if it don't make the cut, it don't make the cut. Bro. Why is it so hard? I don't know. Why is that so hard? What the hell is that? That shit is a fake avocado. Guys, this... That joint in the laboratory. Why is it so... Look at that. What is that? Look, babe. I don't know. That shit don't look right, though. No, it doesn't. I don't think I'm going to have it no more. Why is it so hard inside? It looks like it's not good, babe, at all. That is not good. How the hell? Wait, how the hell do they... 
No, that avocado's not good. You can just look at that and tell. It's like... Let's rotten. try the other one. Now I just wasted five freaking dollars. What the hell? I almost want to complain. So do I, but then what do we do? Like, go show back? Show it to him. Yeah, then show it to him. Like, yo, look. This is what the inside looked like. I should... Well, I, I could take a picture off this and show him. Maybe that's what it is. It was called green-skinned avocado. I don't know. That shit did not look right. We, we know avocado. That was no avocado. That was weird. All right, let's try this one. It, why is it so hard to cut? Wow, that's crazy. You could be hitting other things. Yeah. Mm -mm. No. Look. All right, guys. So we do not recommend that. What is this? Avocado. What is this? Why is it like that? Like it's. Look, look. I don't know, baby. Really sucks, guys. Like, like what is this? Like, what? How could it be that hard to peel apart? What is this? A fake avocado, guys? Have you ever seen an avocado like this? Only the outside. What is this? That made me so sad, but I, I'm not really, um, I'm not really surprised. I'm not really surprised the way the day is going. I'm just not really surprised, but, um, I have one more thing to be happy about. I bet you, oh. Kilo made me buy these. These were two for $9. Um... Once I saw the price, I wasn't going to do it. I was actually going to buy the... I was thinking about maybe buying, like, the dough and then making my own. But he was like, just get it, babe. And the reason... I have been craving these. Actually, I've been thinking about them. And I don't think they have them at Walmart. But the reason why I love these so much is because it gives me warm memories. My grandma used to make these for me and I would eat them a certain way and when I eat them I'll show you how I eat them because I peel them layer by layer I don't know if anybody else does that but that's how I eat them and then I leave the last skin and I eat it and I've been eating it like that since I was a child and it just gives me a warm cozy feeling when I see them and eat them because she used to always have them for me so that makes me happy. Just even like looking at this makes me happy. But back in the day, I guarantee you that these suckers were probably like $2 a piece. But wages were different too. So, you know, but whatever. Yeah, they were two for $9. So, um, four fifty each. Yep. Sounds good to me. Yeah. Anyway, eventually I'll make these and then I will show you. Okay. Pickles. Pickles. Butter pickles. They're in there. Give me the mayonnaise, though, because we need more. We definitely need more mayonnaise. Let me just. Oh man, yeah, we do need more. We do need to order another. That's alright. I'll be. I didn't want to use it all just in case we needed it for something. Want to fish or something? Maybe? Something. Unless you do it at work tonight. Yeah, I think I'm gonna. So if you think of anything else. Put on it. Oh, um, those sausages. I gotta do those sausages. Cream, cherries. You mean strawberries? I know where you're going with this. I know exactly where you're going where with this. Where am I going with it? These are butter, right? Yeah, butter. Butter. More, bro. More. Mmm. I used to not like pickles either, and now I love them. Stop. One. Making a lot of weird noises. Okay, guys. He's he's just in a weird mood today. I think it's the shirt. Or it's what's in the shirt. <laughs> <laughs> that looks good. All right, so we're about to eat lunch. I heard your thing was going off. You were planning on working today? I was trying. <laughs> Before all the chaos Did with the freaking bro, thank God. Because if he was working, he could have been working. See, God is good. God is good. Because he could have been, he could have got a call for Uber, and he could have been way far away 
and your girl would have been out there calling the tow truck by herself, all frantic, out in the middle of the street. Because car street. still in the middle of the street. Because my ass wouldn't have been able to push it by myself. I wouldn't have been. I wouldn't have thought like, how do I move the car? Uh, it would have been bad. I would have just called the tow truck. I would have called AAA, and they would have had to come. But yeah, and they probably would have figured it out. But they would have. But then they would have saved the day. Instead, you know. I saved the day. And you know, when a person saves the day, there's probably two things you can give a fella. You know, that's one. <laughs> <laughs> how much? How much bread would you like? I would like. Cause right now I can measure it <laughs> without using my hands. Not just kidding. <laughs> uh, give me there. I think I could be able to eat all that gotcha, young lady. with this nice soft bread. Oh, yeah, that was a little bit more, actually. Look at that. Here, cut it again, right here. All right, middle. Yeah, cut that in half, just in case. If I eat that, I'm gonna go right to sleep. There you go, young lady. Mm. All you need is a bag of chips to go with it. Mm. And, and we got chips. <laughs> we got some chips. Hey, look at that. Go figure. It'd be food. It'd be food that makes you happy, right? Of course. Lady, go. What kind Good of chips you want? We might as well just eat these chips. Might as well. You, you know what? I need plates. to order more paper plates. I, we don't got no more. Oh. Okay. Well, we're Unless plates. they're in here. Um... Here, I can rip this bag and we can just use this bag. No. No, I want to put the chips on it. Well, I don't, I'm not sure. only Doritos. Only Doritos. Oh, I guess that's, the, that's what we're having. Right? Even though you, you're right. Plain. Plain is the best. I know. All right, guys, we're going to eat. Let's watch some paternity. Either paternity or... um. What's the, my wife and uh, kids? My wife and kids. Paternity. Paternity? Yeah. Okay. Look at Mona. Look at how she's looking at my food. She's looking like... Hmm? Oh, you better not. And you got lady hoping I spill another chip. As soon as she drops something, I'm taking it. You couldn't you nice and cozy, Mona? Good, good. I'm glad. Mmm. Like a fatty. Like a fatty. All right, guys, so it's way later. I took a nap, <coughs> and I'm cooking dinner, and this is what I'm cooking. A uh, little bit of ground beef, some garlic, some onions, some adobo. I don't have any garlic powder. And then we're going to cook some penny uh, noodles, and I have this packet of ado uh, Alfredo sauce mix, some butter, some milk, and then I'm going to add some spinach to it. So... Yeah, that's what's for dinner. What? No, babe, you better have not been. You can't see anything, Kilo. Is this technology? Oh my God! So this what technology? Yeah. I hope not. If there's technology, we're we're screwed. This video is not being released. Do you think you think there's technology? Yes, I know there's technology. You do? Yes. Well, there is this video that I put out that I was doing a try on and I blurred it. You're telling me that they know how to unblur it? Yes. They do? Yes. Well then they saw my whole shit. Yeah. So what are you doing? Stop. I don't want money. I mean, I was in I don't I want mean, money like that. Listen, they um they be wearing bikinis that look worse than my underwear. That's they. They can do whatever they want. They don't got that. They can do whatever they, don't, they, they want. They can't do that. Us? I blurred it real good can't. though. I blurred it real good. We can't do that stuff. Nah, I be. Babe, babe, I feel like babe, I be all over the babe, internet. Babe, you can't. You can't ever be this comfortable. This com I am comfortable. Yeah, you can't ever be this comfortable. I mean, there's people in other no, places that just this, walk around with their boobs hanging out, see. hanging out, out.
Sorry guys, you can only see this part of me right now, but yeah. I'm but I'm actually cooking. Video. I'm actually cooking. not supposed to wait for me to stop look at that perfect stop that's funny when it's just me and you not everybody else dude. come on it's Listen, going out it's unless funny. you want me coming out here with my joint rock and, and wearing my sweats hell yeah put them gray sweatpants on bro go get me some nipple covers No, just give me some nipple covers. That's all you care about is my nipples. There's women out here who do not wear bras. Why can't I be one of them? I don't like though. I don't like bras. They're so uncomfortable. All right, guys. This is all you could get. Sorry. Take a long look at them. If you if you have the type technology to um to unblur it, then you go. Leave me a um an extra a extra um what's it called a super chat. Leave me a, if you could unblur this. Leave me a super chat because I deserve it. Can you imagine? That's so funny, babe. I'm all yours regardless. All right, guys. So there's that. I gotta drain that, and I'm waiting for that. You want me to hide my bra too? I want like you to walk to the guys. side. I want you to walk to the side, and then that's it. And then just do what you need to do. All right, guys. So you guys are seeing the way she's doing this meat here. So you can just cut this right in. Um, did you season it or no? Yeah. Okay. So don't you touch so it. You guys saw all the stuff that she does. <laughs> <laughs> You're making me I mad. got the bra. You're making me so mad. I got the bra on. Oh, thank God. Thank you. Good job. <laughs> oh, Melly. Here, look, guys. No, babe. You can't get this tall. You <laughs> Babe, what's put the a, difference? Put a freaking shirt on, woman. <laughs> Are you serious? Let me just show them. No, funny. no, it's not funny. You think you slick. They got technology. They probably even took me out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's what, how you did it? What? Okay, that was funny. That was yeah, funny. what were you trying to do? I thought you just had your bra on. No, right, so that's that what is I funny. did. That, that's funny. Okay. <laughs> that is funny. You thought I just had my bra on? Yeah, I thought you were well, trying to be funny. You know the, what I mean? In the summertime. Like, I got my bra on, but that's all no. I got on now, like. In the summertime, what's the difference? What's the difference? This is what my bikini looks like. So, guys, just wait till the summertime. You want to see my knockers? Just playing. I understand. This is my new look, though. Honestly, though, man, if my if my chest region was smaller you gonna be hit kilo because if i ever lose weight and i am smaller up top like smaller smaller yeah i'm i'm going braless there is no reason like for people with small boobs yeah, yeah nice, if, if you got like nice if, if i look at you and you can't tell you got boobs sure and you can't tell I got boobs. Yeah, sure. Go topless. Nipple Go covers. Boobless. Nipple, nipple covers, tell. right? No, you can tell. Even if you put nipple covers off and the joints are still two big ass boulders right here. <laughs> okay, nipple covers. Can't Why you had to bring them down here, though? <laughs> I'm at two boulders. How, why you had to bring them down there? Because they're big and they're heavy, you know? That's messed up, bro. <sighs> are you along for the ride? The ride. All right, so this is like a dollar something, and honestly, you could buy a jar. But to me, the jar of Alfredo tastes disgusting to me. So I would rather make my own. So this is one and three fourths cup milk and one tablespoon of butter. 
I know that we said we're watching our cholesterol, but you, you got to put enough. You got to put enough butter in here. So we're not doing one tablespoon. We're doing about three, unfortunately. I mean, I have, last time I did my chicken, I did not fry it. So I think we're doing, I think we're doing good here, guys. I think we're doing good. Um, okay. So this is a pretty quick, quick meal. So one and three fourths. Milk. A milk, a milk. Milk, a milk. Nothing for you, baby. Nothing's gonna drop on this here floor, baby. All right, noodles are ready. The penny, the penny is in. I'm gonna do a drizzle of olive oil. You see the bingo arm? Bingo. I still got them bingo arms. Okay, draining the meat. As we speak, this is going to be a fun, a fun part. <laughs> Torturing my husband. <laughs> That's why he loves me. Very spontaneous, guys. You got to be spontaneous sometimes. Just make them, you know, throw them for a loop. You can't be too boring. You need to do the the shock factor. Like, wow, she would do that. <laughs> to me, I I just don't see the difference because a bikini. I don't wear a bra in a bikini. Anyway, I'm going to switch my bra on the inside now. <laughs> okay, we're all done. <laughs> we got the noodles right here. And we're going to put the meat in here. That was pretty damn fast if you ask me. And, and I think I'm going to give it a little mixy mix. I wish Kilo liked um, mushrooms because I would totally do that, but he doesn't. And then we're going to pour this right here inside right here with the spinach and yeah here I'm going to show you it smells good there you go that was quick though right guys a little bit of ground beef a little packet and it's cheaper actually because the actual sauce is like two something. Unless you get the Prego stuff, and the Prego stuff I definitely don't like. I gotta taste it though because sometimes it's not salty enough. And if you really want, you could put some Parmesan cheese on it. Oh, I hear Kilo. I hear. I hear Kilo watching my. Or he set up my wife and kids. Let me try to taste it though. Tastes good. I gotta be careful for my for my um sodium intake too, but it's done. That's good. Don't hesitate. Okay. Knorr, knorr, knorrs. Go get it, guys. And then you can even scan for more recipes. I think I'm gonna scan that later. And see what the next recipe is because I do have another one. So yeah. How we do
this makes a lot. I think I can even um, freeze some of it for like a side of, for a different meal. For some reason, she likes this plate right here. I don't know why I was like that as a kid, too. I like to eat off of plastic for some reason. I don't know why. But I guarantee you she's going to say, don't give me a lot. I'm not that hungry. Because she eats when she comes home. Yeah. Good morning. You want more? This is how we roll. Okay, guys. Or I can give some to Tony when he comes over. But this is, it looks good. Actually, Kilo, kilos look really good. So. You can put some tomatoes in there. And it would be even better. Bon appetit. 